Ah, hello again guys. Um, it is Drew here for Farm Simulator 17 and today we are going to be taking a look at our newest map on this game called Oregon Springs 17. Um, as you could... Okay, that's very nice. Um, <laughs> um, but it is a US map obviously. Um, as you can see here it is quite a good size map. So I may, this will definitely be a multi-part um, uh, map review. I'm not sure if two, I think two may do it, possibly even three, I'm not sure. Um, but anyways, let's go ahead and get started, guys. Oops, sorry there, buddy. Didn't mean to start you up. What we're going to go ahead and do here is take our little truck. And this is the other thing I should mention. I love the fact that this area has like these huge sheds in it. So obviously you have somewhere to put this big guy so he doesn't have to sit out. Actually, let me go ahead and just put him in here. Okay, get him in and out of there. Because this is basically where you can like customize, come in and customize your vehicles too, so. And let's go ahead and start the tour. Okay, and basically, as you guys can see here, uh, we do have like a little tank for. I'm not sure if you. I'm not sure if you can actually do anything with the tank. I'm not sure. Um, it might just be there for decoration. But here, you do have your. It looks like sea containers, possibly. I'm not sure. Unless they're just decoration, I'm not sure because a lot of this stuff is new. So there's more containers over here. It might be. Okay, yeah, these look like see the fertilizer containers. It looks like, obviously. Um, obviously, we have more big sheds. <laughs> Go figure. Oh wow, we do have equipment in here. Okay, I forgot that we had equipment in here. Actually, now um, we do have an active um, a Massey Ferguson seventy three seventy four. Guy combine. Uh, we do have a new case. I well, an old the old case. I H. Um, we do have a little fent 310. So um, obviously that is very nice. And then we do have a little back room here with nothing in it. <laughs> Which actually, if you took that if you took that back room out, you could actually fit a lot more in that garage. But you know that's just me. So oh, we do have this little area up here for nothing. <laughs> I mean, I mean, it is, does give a nice overhead view, but, you know, it doesn't, uh, I don't think, oh, there's more, okay, there's more implements in here, okay. This is nice. We do have a Deutz Farce, um, a little grain trailer, cedar, and a cultivator. Very nice, very nice. All right, where's my truck? Where's my truck? There it is. Okay, we'll go ahead and move on. Obviously, I'm not going to open those two. As you guys know, it's just the back side of the shed where I have the big bud. You can see it sitting in there, so we're not going to mess with that right now. And there's the American flag. America, yeah, woo! <laughs> um, yeah, okay. Um... Okay, and here we do have our silos, which are very nicely done, Avi. Um, actually, good size too. We do have some storage facilities over here, as far as for storing equipment. This is nice, actually, because usually on consoles. 
Oh, and I should recommend. I should uh, say that's what I am playing on right now is a console. Because I do have the game for PC as well, but I don't have a microphone, so anything that I would record on there, I can't speak. So, um. But yeah, very nice silos there, guys. Uh, very nicely done. Let's go ahead and. You know what? Let's go ahead and start at the train station. That way we can just kind of work our way through the map. And I do really love this map, too. This is. This is nice. gate or something? Oh, I guess it is. Huh. Never seen one like that before. Huh, that's interesting. Oh, okay. I was about to say, why does it say train station? I don't see any train tracks. Um, obviously, apparently, you just... Apparently, this is, like, log-related. It must be. Okay, yeah, selling point for wood. And then I'm assuming you would load it onto a train over here, maybe? Because there's no train around. And obviously, um, the one train you do have, you don't get to unload. Or you don't get to drive. And I'm assuming it would just come in here and just... Huh. It would just probably come back in here and just you load uh, wood on it I'm assuming if we ever even do see the train I'm not sure because I haven't really messed around with this map yet so um, that could just be a mystery so um, we'll go ahead and move on there Here we do have a barn. I do love how this. I do love this feeling of like countryside as you're driving along, you know, dirt road, the little fences. This is nice. And that would be over here. Yes. And obviously, as you guys can see, many, 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 many trees. Um, Good forestry, good forestry though. And this is Full Heart Farm, alright, cool. Um, how do we get in here? What in the hell? Oh, okay, there it goes. I was just like, what in the hell? How do we get... Oh, that's nice, it just kind of like... Pulls back and falls down onto the ground. That's nice. We do have our little straw and hay selling point. Nice little house there. Couple storage bins. You know, the weird thing is, in all honesty, um, obviously, since this is on console, guys, um, the only thing I will say I wish we had for console is something, like, little that we could, you know, something little that we could actually fly on here so that we could, I could actually fly around and just look at everything from an aerial perspective because that actually would be a lot more interesting. 
than just trying to drive around all the time but um it that would that would be kind of a that would kind of be a kind of a um script situation which consoles will not um <laughs> which will not work with consoles so yeah forget that idea but it is a nice idea i mean obviously i can do it on pc because pcs are not limited um so i mean you, you know it it really all depends So, yeah, I mean, there is that, so. More storage area, more pits. Very nice. And there's there a little pond or something back here? A little fuel tank there. Oh no, that must be on the other road. Okay, that's my fault, sorry. Oh, just drive around circles here. <sighs> Guys, it's gonna be a maze to get out of here. And then we'll go back here. Yeah, there's a little area of water back there. I don't know if you guys can really see it, but... Nothing out of the ordinary, really. And more fields up here. Okay. Let's go ahead and drive through here real quick. Not going through the field. But I want to go ahead and get down here real quick to the shop. So I can end this video and start part two. I mean, as you can see there, there's the uh, Oregon Spring specific grain there. Okay. Alright guys, that is going to be it for part one of Oregon Springs Map Review. I will catch you guys on part two.